Hey, babes. Hello, hello, hello. Good afternoon. Okay, so I know people have seen the grandest new interview, right? And I know people have spoken about it and, and found what they found within it because, yes, there are still lies happening. Because what? The story keeps changing. So, I just wanted to put out there some things that I was picking up on and some questions that I have. So, the very first thing that I noticed, um, well, with the particular video I was watching at the moment, um, Grandis mentions Rose Bly missing, and she says that she was the baby of the family. Um, well, Summer is also the baby of the family, right? And I noticed that the dogs were barking, and then I started recalling that every single interview that has ever been done on the Wells property, the dogs were present. Every single one. Coincidence? Nah, don't think so. Okay, then, <clears throat> you know, Grandis adds the whole nap situation. Um, didn't I say that in one of the videos I just recently posted? I said... Candace said, what if I did this wrong, uh, right? What if I did that right? What if I would have went outside with her? And I said, so basically she said, right? I said, what if I, I didn't do this? And what if I didn't do that? So there's two things that she did. And I said to you guys, did she get high? Mm -hmm. Okay. And not off. Because if now we know Grandis was sleeping. <laughs> and what if I did this right? And what if I did that right? So there's two major things that she did wrong that sh her brain computed immediately to, to spit out those answers. Okay. Um, so the dogs were there too. The nap. Um, and immediately everybody said they were abducted, that she was abducted. Um, and, uh, yeah, I'm sorry. This just gets me upset when I start reading the situation into the situation. Um, bear with me. I'm sorry. This is just messed up. The very first thought everybody thought was that she was abducted, yet you had children looking for her by themselves. Um, remember, Dawn said he that the boys were down in the creek looking for them. What? That don't even make sense, right? Then we're going to go fast forward to the water part, okay, where she's talking about the water hole. Hold on. One second. Okay. Um, Grandis says, at the horse stables, I believe that that's where. So, I believe that's where. She says, at the, at the water something, right? At, and then she said... At the horse stable. I believe that's where. How do you believe that's where if you were there? <laughs> oh, my God. Again, hashtag make it make sense. All right. And then Candace says prior to this about the water hole, everything goes slow motion. <clears throat> well, thankfully for you guys, I have been through trauma. Okay, and when trauma happens, guess what? Everything goes slow motion. Everything goes slow motion. And when you replay it in your head, guess what? It's slow motion. Okay, are you okay? Oh, you're at the desk. <sighs> so now we have Grandis saying she believes that's where the water hole is. <laughs> and Candace saying everything goes slow motion here. But remember, they they had Hunter there. So if something happened right then and there, Hunter was there. Okay? Now, after that, they say that they dropped Hunter off. Did they go back to this area? Just a question. Um, did they go back? It's very possible. You know, like she said, 50-50, right? Hmm. So now, I just wanted to touch on one more thing. <clears throat> I did a video where I was um, showing you that Candace was intoxicated on the day that people were looking for Summer, instead of looking for Summer, um, laughing and kikiing about Don and how he's an asshole, you know, instead of looking for your daughter, 
right? Um, and then somebody in my comments mentioned, you know, oh, I've never seen Candace act like this towards somebody. The way I was like, oh, look, she's she's nodding off again. Ugh, right? Ugh. She kept nodding off, right? And to my babe, I just wanted to let you know, um, I'm an empath. I was picking up on her feelings. Those were not my feelings. I'm not drugged. I'm not, ugh. I'm not that. So I was picking up on her feelings as an empath and expressing them to you so you could see it as well. Okay. So I wasn't picking. I was showing you what I was feeling from her. Okay. Again, I'm sorry. I don't buy their story. You can't pay me to buy their story. Okay. I love you, babe, so much. Tell me your thoughts in the comments, too, if you noticed anything that I might have missed. I, I didn't want to touch on the, the obvious things that were said um, that everybody else is talking about. I just want to pick up on things that, you know, that I pick up on, not somebody else picks up on. I did pick up on that immediately. It was like the first couple of sentences where it's like, what did she just say? But any I love you, babes.